Hi, I just checking in. I had my first day of working new to my new position as an SDR. I also had <laughs> the first case of sushi and the second case right here is supposed to be for tomorrow, but I'm really, really hungry. So I'm eating it now because I have no discipline. Well, I have some discipline. Anyway, it was just a lot of Zoom, Zoom meetings, a lot of reviews of what what our goals are and I'm just so excited to have a job. I'm just really, really excited. <sighs> yeah, that's all I have to say right right now, as of right now. And they said that my computer should be coming in the mail soon, so I'm just waiting on that. And I'll show you the full official setup when I have it here. All right, so 10 more minutes before I start, <clears throat> before I start another Zoom meeting with my new position. Um, it's training all week and I just want to say that I woke up early but I don't know I, I went back to I went in and out of consciousness until like seven o'clock and I realized I have to get up I have to eat I have to work hopefully hopefully I can well not hopefully I will I will turn myself into a person that can sleep at an appropriate time and wake up at a appropriate time to yeah to carry out routine and that's all I want to say right now I want to cry like a child because I never had an injury like this since I was a child but I, I fell and I do you see that do you see how deep that is I'm gonna need stitches I'm gonna take myself to the hospital and see what can be done about it but that's way too deep I had stitches there from when I was a kid and I feel like I busted open when I fell and fell on my chin. <laughs> I wanna, I'm, I'm taking myself to the hospital, right? But I wanna cry like a baby. I've never experienced an accident like this since I was a baby. I have my phone, I have my wallet, I have my keys. I have this dog. Trying to follow me outside. Mm. I want to get back home in time before my boss. Oh, damn it. Well, that's not going to happen, right? That's not realistic. And then my lips. Can I really go? Okay. I'm not going to the hospital with chap lips. It's just not going to happen. So I just sent a message to my boss along with um, a picture of the wound. I don't know if that was appropriate, but just to get him to believe me that it's really, really bad. Really, really bad. And right now I'm just, I'm at, I'm just waiting for my Uber to show up. All my years of TV taught me, you take yourself to the emergency room when things go wrong, so. That's where I'm going right now. I should comment that I think I think my fall is due to me. I should first comment that I was I had the zoomies again, the ADHD zoomies. And that's kind of what caused my fall again just moving around the place and I think me falling and having this cut that affects my job is the universe telling me it's time to stop I'm having flashback memories to when I was a child and got these stitches on my chin in the first place I don't remember much, but I remember sitting in a medical place and my parents being there. I don't know if I was drugged or not to feel the pain, but you know, I don't remember getting hurt. But I just remember that I was, I did have a wound and my parents were watching me get some sort of care for it. And I... I slightly remember it. I'm, I, I, whenever I see the stitches under my chin, I slightly 
you remember it? Like where these stitches came from? Oh, probably from that. But it's definitely coming back to me. Isn't that crazy? It's all coming back to me. Just a more, a stronger memory. I'm free. Just in time to get back to work, hopefully. Bye. I'm just hoping that it won't scar too bad. I don't think I took footage of the um, finished of the stitches, but they want me to come back in two days, so that's what I'm going to do as soon as I'm done working it. I'm back home. I'm fine. My chin hurts. It was only, what, five stitches? I don't know if I said in the last video. Yeah, five stitches. Pretty short. I got back in time to intend a perf a an important Zoom meeting, and that's what's up. I mean, life of Genosha. Okay, I am reporting to you from an empty parking lot because I I made the weird mistake of telling the hospital that my pharmacy was all the way in Plantation when I was in Miramar. Now, I don't know why I did that. So. I'm in Plantation, yeah right now, I took a bus all the way up here, but now I'm taking an Uber to go all the way down there to pick up my meds, and it's, it's near 8.30 and the pharmacy closes at 9 o'clock, so because I thought it would be a good idea to do a little bit more work first before I came down here, but that is the stake we're looking at right now. I should get there on time, but... Adulthood. Okay, go ahead and enter your phone number on that big hat for me. Hey, I got it. <laughs> I got it on time.